Katrina and I are just kind of walking around, taking things in, and um, she's walking around like she knows where she's going, but I think she's kind of lost. <laughs> I really do. I'm never lost. We don't really do RV tours per se as much as we do just walk around the show, enjoy it from a spectator's point of view, kind of just walk in and look at a few rigs and see what's going on and soak in the atmosphere because that's kind of the way we roll. That's kind of the way I roll and she follows along. Oh, <laughs> okay. Okay, so we're like the average spectator. We do the same thing. So we're walking by, Katrina sees something that caught her eye. She wants, I want to go in and check it out. So it's the Class A, it's the Jayco Seneca XT 32U. So for fun, we're going to go walk in and check it out. Let's do it. I don't know. I think I think the design on the outside caught her eye. Not that it matters, but. I had to. I'm sorry. That looks like a king size. That's actually decent. And you know what? Honestly, the um, I actually like. I don't mind this. Actually, the bed looks like a nice size. I like all the windows, and I like the nightstands beside there. Well, what was interesting? Big. The the gentleman walked in and said this was too small. Yeah. God forbid we tell him what we're driving now. We're not going to. This is a huge we're upgrade. And actually, really, it's not. I mean. And actually, to be honest with you, the this looks like very. I like that. I like this wood. It's very pretty. Now it's a little bit more rustic than I would want myself, but I like that. What about the uh, bathroom in there? Oh, I don't know. Let's see. It's not big. Like you really? said, it's it's not. I mean, it's it's long, but it's not. You know, you don't have a lot of depth here. But it's not bad. It's not bad. I don't think it's bad at all. Oh, well, it's got a residential. No, uh, very heavy. Is it? Yeah, it's very heavy. So that's a good thing. That's a good thing. Well, you just like the look on the outside, and then you said, hey, I got to come in and check it out. Look, I, I mean, actually, it's not bad. I mean, it's think about it. If you're bad. getting this for your first rig. Again, you know, I, I want it. recliners. I would want theater seats. I'd want theater seats. Okay. But I like this. I like the big screen TV. And it's, it's nice. the cab out in the front down here, you could easily drive this. Yeah. Look oh, at that. Look at that refrigerator. Yeah. Freezer. It's a huge refrigerator. Yes. Not bad at all. Like it. Okay, so this passes the KB test. Yes. You would? I would, I would argue right. this. Yeah, I would. All right, I don't know. I'd have to do a little bit more research on the rig to see if uh, what the... Um, but the design is great. It does kind of have that cool off-road look to it. really tough, cool. Thing. You know, there's another one. It converts to a bed. I would like a little... Okay, I just want to go real quick. Oh, come in here. This is All right, okay, now I'm... I'm I'm digging this. Yeah, this is. Look how cool this is. Oh, I'm digging this. Right? Yeah, I like this. I don't know why uh -huh. it's different. Yeah. This is different. It's almost like an airstream feel back here. Like, like I don't know about. Would, like, no, well, no. it's got a lot of windows. Yeah, like the whole window is like this, and then this here, and I assume that this is your eating area too. No, not really. Is there? No. Yeah, this would be. This kind of. Oh, I like all the light. Yes. This is all but I do like the feel of this. It's really different. I'm, Even when I'm you don't have the table out or whatever is here, it's nice and wide open. Let's look at the bathroom. And wait a minute, where's there? Is there? I don't see a TV. Oh, there it is. It's right here. There. So that's not is, bad. I, so if you sit here, the only thing is, if this TV does not swivel, that's a problem. Well, still, it's but, not bad. But this right here, that's so cool. Yeah, and it looks like it looks like maybe something goes in here, like a table goes in there. Or like that's something. something to help hold the bed. See so if you got in okay. here for a bathroom. Actually, it's kind of cool. Yeah. This may have been the perfect rig to take on our trip. What were you thinking? Without the perfect price tag, that's yeah. the price tag would have been a little bit too high. But very cool. Taking this, this is really cool. Yeah, I'm kind of liking this. Yeah. Right. Uh -huh. Induction countertop, yeah. I mean induction um, stove top. Is that one, one sink? One sink. Oh yeah. I can offer. Yeah, this is this is kind of cool with you. See this, like I was telling you guys, this is what we do. We don't have any kind of game plan and any kind of. We just come out here and wing it as if we were coming to the show as a just a regular spectator a so we just kind of walk around and look at things and share them with you and i love the window just like in our little guy i like that window. i like all the light this has a nice amount of light in here so i'm really digging that yep. just, they like to leave the information the cards in the sink or the microwave so always look okay. 
All right, once again, this is, I'll let you know what it is. All right, so this is the Jayco Seneca XT 29T. Okay. It is a gross vehicle weight, 22,000. I'm not gonna get into all of this. Um, the overall length is a little over 30 feet. So it's a little bit smaller than our first rig we had, but still, it's kind of cool. I like it. I like it. What is this right here? Is this like, for, like outdoor? Um... Storage. That's past due storage. Ooh, that's nice. That's nice. Look at that past due storage, guys. That's, that's nice. pretty cool. Look, when Chris gets in the doghouse, this is his bed. And that's all the time. All the time, Chris's doghouse. Yeah. What's in here? Let's look at the storage. Yeah. Nice storage. Nice. Yeah. Very nice. It is. More storage. Wow. I'm sure there's storage on the other side. Wow. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool looking. It's pretty cool to say the least. This is new for 2024, guys. The 2019. Gorgeous. Look at that. I like that one a lot. So Katrina and I are just walking around, enjoying the show. One of the things we love is meeting people and especially subscribers. I want to ask you guys to introduce yourselves. Go down the line. Where are you from? Tell me. Kathy from Florida. Norma from Tennessee. Tim also from Tennessee. And Kevin from Florida. How about that? And they all agreed all right. to take me and out. Katrina from Maryland. Free food and drinks. How sweet of them. They're so <laughs> awesome. But anyway, we really do appreciate it. It's so nice of you guys. It's good to meet you. Yeah. No, thank you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Yeah. All right, guys. We'll look enjoy forward to you. you. Thank you. Great show. Take care. You too. Stay in touch. All right. All right. Enjoy. See? That's what I love. That's so fun. I love that. That's so fun. Hey guys, it's Chris and Katrina with our Everyday Getaway, and we want to take a few minutes to tell you about the sponsor of this week's video, RVMattress.com by Brooklyn Bedding. Now, one of the first things that we did is we upgraded our mattress in our Class A diesel pusher app right after we bought it because the mattress was kind of so so worn. You're going to want to upgrade your mattress, so you're going to want to do so by going to RVMattress.com by Brooklyn Bedding. Now, who exactly is our RVMattress.com by Brooklyn Bedding? They make mattresses specifically designed for RVs. Doesn't matter if you have a Class A or a Class C or a travel trailer or a fifth wheel, chances are they got you covered. Some of the great things about RVMattress.com, they have a 120 day sleep trial. Yeah, so you could try it out and if you don't like it, you could send it back. They also have a 10 year warranty and they have a factory in Arizona. Arizona. And what else did you say they have? They have when free shipping. Free shipping. Free shipping. That's shipping. it. They Which have free shipping. Which is always awesome. I mean, because you got to figure something of that size, you know, is going to have a little price tag on it. So free. free is always good. The mattress we got in the Class A was the Aurora Deluxe. Aurora Lux. Aurora Lux. And it was a mattress that had like a cooling element in it or, you know, it was, it it, it for does. those of you who sleep hot and sweat like me. Chris is, ew, he's, uh, oh, he's, come on sweaty. now, be nice. <laughs> they also have mattress covers. They have sheets. What else? They have weighted blankets. What else do they? Oh my gosh. They, they have pillows. pillows. All kinds of good stuff. Right. They'll have something for you. You got to go check them out. RVmattress.com by Brooklyn Bedding. You can use our code getaway. Go to rvmattress.com forward slash getaway. Use the code getaway. You'll save 25% on your next purchase. And I'm telling you guys, it has been phenomenal. You deserve a good night's sleep, especially you full-time RVers when you're on the road. You got to get a full, you got to get that good night's sleep. You won't regret it. You will not regret it. rvmattress.com forward slash code word getaway. And we return you to our regularly scheduled video. Thanks, guys. I'm all nervous because hey, Matt's here. I'm all, I'm all nervous because Matt's here. One and you're just looking for What's going on, everybody? Yeah. Welcome to the Hershey RV Show 2023. He'll, he'll be done in a second. We're just walking around to get a chance to stop by and say hi to Matt. Your videos are, I mean, really? Really? Yes, really. This is awesome. No, no, I love you guys. Uh, thank Our you everyday for getaway. I, I follow. Thank I subscribe, you. just like you guys should. Hi. There's Andrea. Hi, How are you? I'm nice good. to meet you. And a little nice insider in information, the people that work at FedEx, Thanks for losing our orange yes. tent. I know we couldn't. We find were you. looking yes. for the orange tent. I know, tent. I know. I but uh, we looked over here and I'm like, it's going to be orange. I yes. Know. It's general. General gave so, us a tent, so we're nice good. You Have you guys too. seen my new toilet chemical? No, is this newer than the one you gave us in Florida? No, no it's the same, same thing. Same thing. Yes. Liquefied. Well, actually, 
Did you guys try this? Yeah, we love it. Well, we did have two RVs like, now. It's only yeah. one, so we need another. Well, did, would you like orange or lavender? Uh, orange. Oh, I like okay. orange. No, no, I want lavender. Okay, well, never mind. The boss, the boss is spoken. This. No, no, no. This is how we do it. That's for you so and that's for you. Tell me the smell. Just a different smell. Okay. So this is liquefied. It's our brand of black tank toilet treatment created by the Matt's RV Reviews team. All you need is one ounce most of the time, and you just squeeze the bottle and dump it in. If it's really hot, or if you eat some Tijuana flats, you might need two right. ounces. <laughs> but all the other brands of toilet chemical tells you two ounces at a time, which means this 32 ounces only works 16 times. I tell everybody one ounce at a time, and some people do need two ounces, but it's easier to add than it is to subtract. You know very, what I'm saying? And um, because Will and Jen, they only use one ounce, we use one ounce. Um, but there is some people, there's some people that might need three ounces because waste is enzymes and bacteria or bacteria i think Chris and so is kind of a three type of guy yeah yeah oh yeah you're yeah. you're you're a three ounce type that. of guy thank you so much that's more information than they need well hey that's why we're giving you guys all this liquid <laughs> that's why we're getting two guys you can go to primepoopinposition.com to pick up a bottle all right awesome so matt from matt rv review told us to come over and to the winnebago section and look out the echo which is comparable to the jayco oh let me look at my paper because i like this Chi -Chi. Seneca. The Seneca. Yes. So we're going to go check out the Echo now. I think the Echo is what yeah. Tanya and Dave. and Dave had from Turn It Up World. And they were part of RV Unplugged. That's what they had. Mm -hmm. I don't believe we ever got inside their rig to check it out and see we it. We did not. So we're going to go over we here and check this out. We were not invited, Tanya. Let you, and we're going to let you know which one that just on the surface, without getting into the specs, without getting into the reviews, which Hits one we us like. that we like better. Yeah, so let's go our check it out. first impression. Let's do our let's first impressions. Okay, first impression of the Echo. Here's an Echo right here. So this one was longer, but that's okay. This is 23 foot, so these both are the same in terms of length. Like the these two floor, echo, it looks Echoes like the here. Same floor plan too. So let's go look. All right, so wait a minute. Let me look outside here. You got the propane tanks. You got some nice storage back here. You know, that's not bad with the storage. And then the door in the back opens up to give you a little bit more. So let's take a look. Yeah, this is very different. Interesting. Interesting. What do you uh -huh. think? I'm not digging it. You don't? It's mm -mm. not for you? Nope, it's not for me. See, the first thing, I it I don't have a problem with it. I really don't. But when we get to a situation like this, let's check out. The, is this a wet bath? Sure enough. It the is. The other one was not a wet bath. What the? Oh, yeah. The... um. So, and it's, I wonder if it's a cassette, which is... The Seneca was not a wet bath. Yes. Some storage down there. I don't mind this, but here's the thing about this. When I look at all of this, I like where the TV is. I like this. I, this is okay. Look up top. And I like that. That's pretty cool. The extra room up there. But here's the thing I don't like. What? Is I think about Tucker when it comes to something like mm -hmm. this. And Tucker, ours is bad. Ours is bad enough. Yes. This would be worse for Tucker. There is much less space in here for him than even in our little guy, it seems. Right. So yeah. on the surface, I like it if it were just you and me and um, two uh, propane burner. Talk. This looks like, can you tell me if this is convection? If it's plastic inside, it's not, right? Um, I gotta read the front of it. I see nothing. This looks like it's just a regular microwave. Okay. Yeah. Refrigerator small. Yeah obviously obviously but okay. so um compared to the jayco no i would go i'm with you i would go with the jayco but that's on the surface that's, of everything that's just that's just our first impression right so let's make sure we keep saying that it's a first impression it doesn't it's not a comparison between the two like yeah we're not doing like um a breakdown of reviews and miles and towing and all that other stuff we're just kind of looking at it on the surface i do like it it's kind of cool it's got that you know outdoor adventurous kind of vibe to it so this one all right it's 23 so this one's got okay so this one's got a setup out here like that check that out and if you are looking around and you see these big diesel pushers you know kind of like that i like that, that outdoor he's over here talking to a customer so i don't want to disturb him it's a solid cool. this is i think it's it does yep 
and they actually changed. So the question is, do they have a so refrigerator and everything indoor? I imagine they do. No Don't you? You can see. Yes. Uh, oh, okay. The screen, so you can no longer right. those are... Uh, so you have an indoor and outdoor. That's kind of cool. I like that. I do like it, but still. But still what? If I had to compare the two, I'm Jacob. There you go. That's our kind of a quick rundown of comparison between the Echo and the Jayco. What is it, Katrina? The what? Seneca. The Jayco Seneca. Yeah. Tell us what you think. Leave a comment down below. Tell us what you guys think. The next morning. All right. Today is the second day of the uh, Hershey RV show. Katrina and I are going to walk inside, walk around, and enjoy the atmosphere. We have um, a couple things we're going to give away to probably one or two lucky people. Uh, some um, pillows from, pillows from uh, it's rvmattress.com by Brooklyn Thank Bedding. You. Thank you. They gave us a few things to give away, so over the next two days we'll just give them uh, away. But uh, we're going to walk inside and uh, check things out. And it's a very beautiful day. It's gorgeous. It's a nice day. This the temperature is, the is perfect. So yes. All right, so let's go see what we got. Okay. Take you guys with us. See how it goes. No, he's hey. in trouble all the time. He's constantly in the doghouse. Yeah, <laughs> constantly. I'm, I'm, uh, <laughs> and here we are with Mike and Cappy. Yes. And they stopped us. Michael. And Michael, Mike, whatever. <laughs> it's all good. He said Michael. He doesn't care. No, he doesn't she's care. Right, right? He we'll doesn't talk, talk off camera. Might. We'll talk no, off camera. But anyway, I don't like once Twitter, again, though. how nice it is to meet subscribers and friends. It's great. It's fantastic. So we just wanted to give you guys a little shout out for the channel. Oh, is that okay? Yeah. Oh, no, absolutely. All right. No, we love the channel. We, uh, we appreciate the fact you said hi to us it means a lot to us i can't tell you it really does that you would take the time to come over and say hi to us we appreciate it and we appreciate you guys thank you we love your channel thank you okay. all right katrina and i have been walking around this is day two of the show yes we've been walking around all day with these pillows that we got to give away so why we didn't give them away earlier i don't know what we were thinking we must like to walk around with boxes <laughs> so we're just kind of hanging out we were hanging out with uh kenny and sabrina from moving forward we have been following them for years on uh youtube they have a channel and i've always wanted to meet them both and we finally got to meet them after and all they're these years awesome. even better in person great couple it was a big deal for me to meet them both so katrina and i are going to try to give these away let's see what happens how do we want to do this Let's walk and see if anyone recognizes us, and then we'll just... If not, we'll just go from there. It's going to be random. All right, let's see what happens. Okay. What's up? How you doing? Good, how are you? Here we go. Here we, here we, no, here we go. Here we go. All right, we're going to put you guys to the test. All right. First of all, uh, who are you and where are you from? Tell us where you, who you are. Tom and Missy Northam, Salisbury, Maryland. Oh, Marylanders. Yeah, awesome. you're, sp you're supposed to stop by and have crabs with us. Yes. Oh, <laughs> oh. Oh, 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 I'm so sorry. I apologize. I am so sorry you guys sorry. reached out to us. How are you doing? Nice to meet you. Uh, Jim Silver from Montoursville, Pennsylvania. Jim, how you doing? Oh, Good to God, meet you. Nice to meet you. Yeah. We're at the Thousand Trails. Izzy and MJ. Oh my God, here we go. Let's go. <laughs> Got everybody. That was a party. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. He wants to sell me liquid spring upgrade. That's <laughs> it's it's up and rolling. It's up to you. What do you think? Would you like Luxury Brooklyn Betty? Memory, huh? you, ever, you ever heard of Brooklyn Betty? Yeah, we have a Brooklyn Betty. You know we don't you have the memory foam pillow. You know what you need? What do I need? You need two. Do you want them? Do you need them? They're yours. Do They're I brand need to new. Answer a question. I, no. no. Is it trivia? No. 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 It's no. free. If you yeah. want them, it's free. They gave Absolutely. It. What about this one too, yeah, right? You get two. Yes, oh, yeah. for both of you. One for she both of you. She was just complaining yes. about our bamboo oh, pillow this yeah, morning. Yeah. You cannot go. Thank you. Why would I can give you something and not give your wife oh, something. Oh, awesome. You guys are amazing. Right? That's great. Yeah. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah. Yeah. Man, that's a small mattress. Yeah. yeah. Wow. It is. That's a small mattress. <laughs> and then just like the mattress, you open up and then they, and then they, and then she was absolutely just complaining this morning. She's like, these bamboo pillows See, it was meant to be. We've carried them around all day. All day. Well, thank you very much. I appreciate it. So I'll message you. We'll okay. definitely get together, had drinks, All right. We had a, we finally gave the pills away. We finally found someone pillows to get the pills, pills. too. Pillows. pillows. Did I say pills? I'm just kidding. I Did you? Yeah. We're going to wrap it up here, uh, day two, a little early. We got to get back to the RV. Tucker's there waiting for us. We got some things to take care of. We're going to go out tonight and have a good time with some friends. But we're loving it. We're loving meeting people, hanging out, just taking it in. We didn't get a chance to look at any RVs today. No, but that's okay because we were just walking around meeting people. I, I actually found that more fun. 
Uh, we think it's it, it's much more fun for us to meet people, hang out, and talk, than looking at RVs because we're really not in the market for an RV. We're not in the market, and there's nothing that's out there right now that we're like, oh my gosh, it's like so crazy, beautiful, exciting. Right. So we wanted to share yeah. with you our first two days here at the uh, Hershey RV Show. Hope you guys enjoyed a little bit of a behind the scenes, the atmosphere, and just taking things in and all the excitement. If you guys like this video, please give us a thumbs up. As if, you, if you guys like this video, give us a thumbs up. If this is your first time here, please consider hitting the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. You'll be notified every time we release a video. We're going to sh share some more insights with you uh, for day three and four at the Hershey RV Show. So far, so good. This is amazing. And the weather, beautiful. Yeah. Gorgeous. And remember, guys, any day you can get away is a great day. You guys take care. We will see you. See ya.